Welcome to another episode of Turntable Techniques brought to you by DJ City and Beat Refinery. I'm DJ As One, and today we're going to talk about how to use simple cue point color coding and labeling techniques that should help streamline your performances as well as open up multiple mixing options for your sets. Let's peep it out. Make sure your virtual crate is set up so that you can organize it freely. You can do this by clicking and highlighting the number column of your virtual crate. This way you can add songs and play them going up or down in order. This eliminates having to dig around for the next track. Step two, color coding the tracks. For this example, I will label the group red. Now, when loading the tracks, the scopes of the software should reflect this. Some DJs will use green for clean tracks and or red for explicit. Step three, color code and rename cue points. In this example, I have the first cue point on both tracks set to red. I'm also going to follow the rule of thumb and set the first cue point on both tracks to the first usable downbeat or note that pertains to the mix. The first cue point, which is labeled start, sounds like this. The second cue point labeled propaganda sounds like this. Propaganda! Now let's take a deeper look into this and let's notice that the next two cue points are color coded green as well as labeled mix in one and mix in two. I'm gonna come in pre the downbeat and then I'm gonna mix in with a soft cue point start in, fade it in slowly, gonna let the records play for four bars and then I'm gonna fade it out. No song has just one place to mix in or out of. This time, instead of just fading out, I'm going to add some cue point triggering and scratching out of the mix. Let's peep it out. Next idea is that the next song, which is the third song in this list, can also be mixed into the song that's currently playing. Let's go ahead and load Disparate Youth on the other deck and technically on Pakistan, I have a cue point also labeled Mix In. So naturally in the list, without having to dig around, we're just going to go to the very next track, load it, and lo and behold, we actually can color code the first cue point to be green or something else. Again, we're gonna go ahead and label this red, but clearly now we're gonna use this point to mix in to the section that says mix in on Pakistan. And it sounds like this. As always, thanks for checking out this episode of Turntable Techniques, brought to you by DJ City and Beat Refinery. I'm As One. Don't forget to click like and subscribe, and we'll catch you guys next time. Peace.